What's good guys, if you need to make your ultimate team stronger, go to u7buy.com and buy yourself some cheap and reliable FC24 coins. Once you guys head over to u7buy.com, make sure to use my discount code DAN to get 6% off your next purchase on making that team better. Apart from FC coins, u7buy.com also provides more game services like top op mobile games, gift cards, game keys, etc. Click my link in the description and enjoy the cheapest prices now. Yo YouTube what's going on welcome to another video to the channel y'all yeah, boys and today we got a special player to review I do apologize on uploading this video very very late But I've been a little busy with a lot of videos that we're gonna drop this weekend One of them is gonna be that 91 rated ultimate birthday to Shimeni SPC I do apologize if I'm mispronouncing the name. I'm gonna hurry at the moment We're looking at card 6-2 on the height medium high work rates Four star skill moves, five star weak foot with that right foot. Acceleration type is control lengthy, 87 pace, 84 shooting, 86 passing, 86 dribbling, 91 defending, 89 physicality as well. Play styles that the card comes with long ball pass, jockey, intercept on plus, anticipate, bruiser on plus, aerial, and relentless on basic as well. Now, there's a couple camp styles you could give them. You could give them the shadow, you could give them the engine. Or you could give him the anchor chemistry style. I'm going to play it safe and give him the shadow. Acceleration goes up to 96. Sprint speed goes up to 94. Everything in the defending category either gets maxed out or goes up to 95 like defensive awareness. 89 strength, 88 aggression. Great combination. 80 agility, 81 balance is a little low for somebody with his height and body type. But I know you guys see that. Alternate positions, center back. And center mid, yeah, boys. Yes, sir. In today's video, we are going to be playing Mr. Tushimini in a 4 3 3 formation as a CB right next to that Kanji. I know some people want to see him in the midfield, but let's be honest, guys. This card as a CB looks absolutely insane. He looks like he could be a potential top 10 center back in the video game. We're going to play some games in foot champs, see if the SPC is worth it because he's currently around 1.7 million coins from scratch. And that's a lot of coins for an SBC. Here we go with game number one versus Fnatic TNT. All right, all right. Hopefully the attack is somewhat meta. Um, It's kind of a mid attack, but the midfield is pretty decent. So we do take that. Nice tackle. Great stuff. Nice interception. That was nice. Decent turn for CB. Nice way to block that pass. Very nice. Let's go. It takes the ball away easily from Felix. What the hell is this guy doing? This guy messed up on the goalkeeper. Not bad, not bad. Great pass. Nice interception. Great stuff right there. Great tackle, nice and clean. Oof, very aggressive tackle versus Rofo. Great pass as well. That's an assist. Defense leading to the goal contribution. Things you love to see. Very nice on blocking that shot. Very clutch. Very clutch tackle inside the box. Things you love to see. Very nice tackle. This man's locking it up. Great tackle once again, y'all boys. All right, nice interception. He's doing a great job on intercepting the ball. I mean, he does have intercept on plus, so it makes sense. And a good pass right there once again. 
Very nice interception, and he keeps onto the ball with that insane physicality. Man, the interceptions, like I said before, is A1. Oh, it's a counter for this guy. Let's see. Are we able to stop this? Yes, we am, man. The physicality sent that man's son to the ground. Good stuff. It's just way too easy. Way too easy for this man. This guy might be one of the best interceptors in the video game. It's actually insane. Every time somebody tries to ball, pass the ball right next to him, he intercepts it easily. A little counterattack right here, but it's just going to be way too easy defensively for this man. A little switch of the field right there. Good pass. Is he going to get there? Yes, he does. Nice. Body's off drug ball. Nice. little slow on the turn right there that turn was a little bit slow unfortunately i mean it has a lot to do with his body type so nice job Fuck. i need to stop turning with this card man the turning is very bad great tackle bodies off lewandowski nice this man is bodying the shit out of lewandowski this game all right, boys, and that concludes the review for 91 Ultimate Birthday to Shimani. Coming around 1.7 million coins if you do it from scratch on the Xbox and PlayStation. 1.6 million coins on the PC. He is exactly 10 segments. We played three games with the card as a CB in a 4-3-3 formation. Now, I'm going to go ahead and say that this is actually a really, really solid SPC if you play this card as a CB. Now, hear me out. You definitely could play this card as a center mid or as a stay back DM. But I think the best possible position is the center back spot. And I'll get into that in just a second, but the pros right off the bat with this card is that he is 6'2 on the height. Absolutely insane and very big in game. Next is that he has medium high work rates. Medium high work rates are exceptional for a CB or a stay back DM. Next, the combination of the four star skimmels with the five star weak foot. That five star weak foot is massive because he has 93 short pass. 89 vision, 91 long pass with long ball pass on basic. So definitely playing out the back with this card is no issue whatsoever. Next pro from the card is the pace. 80 acceleration, 86 sprint speed. Great pace play right there. He never gets wide balled. He never gets LB wide. Always stands on his feet very nicely. Now the next two things that I love from this card and are arguably the best aspects from this SBC is the defending and the physicality. The physicality, 89 strength. 88 aggression with him being 6'2 and his body type. He is a tank in the back. It's almost impossible to cook this card. If it's like a one-on-one -on -one duo, shoulder to shoulder, Tushimani is going to win that duel 9 times out of 10. And the defending, absolutely insane defensive AI with 93 interceptions going up to 99 with him having intercept on plus, guys. He is one of the best intercepting players I've used an EFC 24. You guys saw the highlights. He was doing a great job defensively. Now, what I don't like from the card, and this is probably a personal thing for me, or maybe it was because of the gameplay, is the turning with the card, specifically the agility and balance. The jockeying is solid. I will say the jockey is pretty good because he does have jockey on basic. But turning with this card out the back is a no-go for me. And that is why I think you should be playing him as a CB. Because if you play him as a CDM or as a center mid, and you, the more you put him up in the pitch, the more you're going to have to utilize him in dribbling wise. And dribbling is definitely the weakest aspect from this card. Yes, you could give him the engine chemistry style, but even then, I don't think it's going to help out that much because of his body type. And we all know EFC 24 usually has bad servers. So the gameplay is pretty much bad. The majority of the time but like i said before if you definitely want to play this card in the midfield you definitely can but i recommend playing him as a stay back dm definitely a solid option but as a cb he's him so definitely complete this spc as a cb he definitely makes the argument for a top 10 cb in the video game he's gonna get thumbs up for me 
is going to get a rating of a 9 out of 10. Absolutely insane. I don't really like the price of the SBC that much because 1.7 is a lot for this card. Like, there's a lot of cards at this stage of the game that are similar price value, if not less, and play the same in game, if not better. So, just keep that in mind. If you're definitely going to complete this SPC, make sure you don't do it from scratch. Thank you guys so much for supporting all the videos. You guys are absolutely amazing. We got a lot of videos to review this weekend. Let me go over once again what we're going to drop. It's going to be that Ultimate Birthday Icon Nesta. Ultimate Birthday Icon Raul. That's double five. Ultimate Birthday Icon Pirlo. Ultimate Birthday Goretzka. And the Ultimate Birthday Icon Stoichkov. So we got a lot of big boys to review. Until next time, it's been your boy Dan FIFA. I am out. Bye-bye.